It's time to blow out the candles. Remember to make a wish, honey. That's my boy. Very good. Happy birthday, son. Did you see that, Dad? Man, they grow up fast. I bet you can remember my sixth birthday like it was yesterday. Mary, could you please clean up? Lucius can help you with the dishes. He can stay up later this evening to play with his new toys, but in bed no later than 10. Yes, ma'am.
If I put the pieces together, this all started years back with the arrival of a new life. Dante Manor was a place filled with darkness, and there were outward ambitions and hidden histories in that house. I tried to help. I should not have become so involved. But how these things unfold when we are thrust on the scene, I can't account for at all. For my part in these events, I waive responsibility. But it's there. It's a mark. A mark I should have noticed. At its source, at the center of it all, was the boy. Lucius, there you are, and here I am, finally, face to face. It's okay, you can trust me. You know who I am, don't you? I've come to speak to you about your calling, my boy. Each offering you bring me will make you big and mighty. It's a simple thing to do, Lucius. You can influence your future, and become a master over all. But oh, so much to do. So much ahead of you. I have some things for the birthday boy. There, on the desk. You'll need this notebook. It will help you on your journey. Excellent. And look, a flashlight. This will help you find your way around at night. Go ahead, pick up your new toys and see how they work. Such a bright boy. Now, Lucius, you need to do a little something. It is important that you are not caught. In the kitchen, you left the lock on the freezer door. You will need to get that padlock, Lucius, and hide it where nobody can find it. Otherwise, they will discover you. And believe me, you wouldn't want that to happen. Go now. Get the padlock before the adults wake up.
Detective McGuffin, what do we got here? It looks like a cardiac arrest, sir. The woman collapsed in the walk-in freezer. This was probably caused by the sudden change of temperature. She was in her mid-fifties. Typical of women her age. Did you talk with the owner of the house? No, sir. They're waiting for you in the kitchen. How can something like this happen, Detective? Was it a seizure of some kind? We'll look into it, but it looks like a case of misadventure. I'd ask that you stay clear of the kitchen and keep staff away while we clean up. Just relax and focus on getting life back to normal. Thanks, Detective. We'll try our best. 